everyone! My name is George Sapperport from Strivers LLC and today I want to tell you all about how to deal with your inner zombies. Now let me explain. As you go out on the walk, you may encounter a certain person. That person may have nothing to deal with your problem. However, that person sparked the idea within you that something is going on. You may not know what it may be. Sometimes it could be set off by the way a person looks, or how a person behaves, or how they act. Whatever the case may be, you ultimately have a problem. And this problem manifests as your inner zombies want to come out of you in a way to communicate something really deep and important to you. However, it's up to you ultimately to confront or to ignore or to expel those inner zombies. How do you deal with them? Well, it's ultimately up to you, the viewer, to decide what to do. We cannot decide for you. You have to make that decision yourself. Nonetheless, I'm going to tell you three ways to deal with your and the zombies. So please listen up. The first point I want to make is that you can choose to ignore them. Oh, it'd be so blissful if you just ignore your inner zombies. No! If you ignore your inner zombies, moreover, it will haunt you. It will get haunting. And it will be a great sense of fear into you. As a result, you will be hindered. You will be feel in burdensome man. And you'll always just feel that you can't get out of this situation. Unfortunately, for most people, they choose this route. And they choose to do it because they don't want to face what they're facing through. However, this is the worst route to take when it comes to dealing with your inner zombies. The next step, which is a better step, is to confront your inner zombies. By doing so, you establish the effort and take the time to recognize that your problem is there, which most likely it is. And by doing so, you already establish that the problem's there and that you're going to solve it with a problem-solving analysis of some kind. And once you act upon that plan, you will ultimately lessen the problem, if not eliminate it. However, it may not always be possible to expel or eliminate those inner zombies. However, it can happen that you may choose to expel those inner zombies. And by doing so, you are freed of the problem at hand. I want to make it clear that not all problems can be solved in a short matter of time. Some of these problems can take months, years, or even decades to resolve. Nonetheless, if you decide to confront them, that is much better already than simply putting your problems aside, letting them haunt you, letting them take over you. When you confront or even get to the point of expelling your inner zombies. You will be a much better person, believe me. If you have any other suggestions on how to deal with your inner zombies, please type them in the comments section down below and please subscribe to this YouTube channel. Please contact me at infoastrivalence.com if you want to schedule a speaking event with us. May you all have a great day today! Take care!